Life is slowly returning to normal, but is this the new normal or has the coronavirus changed things for good? We certainly won't be taking many things for granted anymore. Jobs for what? Although the pandemic taught us a lesson in humanity and solidarity and made us rediscover and appreciate our families more, the lockdown revealed the weak spots of our societies. By closing off many industries and businesses, Many people were left in limbo, unpaid or even permanently jobless. We have entered the recovery phase, opening up slowly, but the gloomy forecast of the International Labour Organization remains. In our region, the number keeps growing as public employment services open up their doors for clients to register. As we look at these daunting numbers, we must not forget that counting is not over and Corona is still a threat to health and economy. Therefore, health and economic measures need to go hand in hand, so we leave nobody behind. Here, I mean specifically informal workers who are not accounted for in these statistics and other vulnerable groups such as women, youth, Roma. They frequently work in the informal sector and now are not even entitled to aid packages provided by the government for those who lost their jobs. So, there is a legitimate question to ask ourselves how to live after surviving coronavirus. The answer is simple, together, finding ways how to help each other. Regional cooperation across the Western Balkans means joint efforts to create more and better jobs and encourage transition from informality to formal sector. Fighting for decent jobs for our citizens, because we are better together. <laughs>